Hi, my name is Kenna and I'm from Texas and I have come to treat my Lyme disease here at the um, Advanced Hyperbaric Recovery Center in Marin. Prior to coming to uh, the facility here, I have, well, let me show you what I have here. This stack here represents uh, at least 15 years of trying to help myself and get medical um, assistance. These represent many, many blood tests, surgeries, many things. It represents a long time of my life that has um, been affected because of Lyme disease, suffering from Lyme disease. Uh, no doubt it's not just affected me, but it's affected my family. It affected my children, um, missing a lot of their teen life, trying to get the help that I needed. For those out there that have any symptoms that are chronic fatigue, I was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, lupus, I had osteomyelitis, different infections, kidney problems, severe chronic pain, and I could not drive for three years because it affected my eyes. There was so much going on in my body, so many different infections and chronic issues that Lyme affected. And I had gotten positive negative tests, I had health insurance, I had access to all kinds of care. and. Over the f past 15 years, explored every bit of that care, and including alternative care and so forth. So rashes, I never had the bullseye. I didn't realize that it didn't have to be embedded in you that, you, that you don't even realize that you've been bitten by a tick. But as someone who once loved hiking, biking, camping, swimming, jogging through the woods, Having lived in Sonoma County all my life, this was something that uh, obviously I was a prime candidate for. So I urge anyone that has any of these symptoms, anything like bipolar, um, severe depression, I came in here to the recovery center with the top 10 of pain, top 10 of depression, not remembering directions or people's names and not remembering sometime that I put my clothes on inside out. That's how bad it, it really was. And so that's what I came to appreciate where I was. This is, was the start, day one of coming into the facility. For me, treatment was a bit, I was nervous. I was in survival mode and I was in pain, so I haven't gone through all kinds of medical treatment. I had I witnessed what it had done for a friend who also had chronic Lyme disease and had seen that person incapacitated because of it. A once very vibrant, strong person and, and knew the truth of it in myself. So it took me some years, but I was able to make it here and I actually I witnessed after her going through the treatments and her phenomenal results, her gaining her life back. I was very excited, but I was also anxious. So for me getting to the chamber, I really, one of the things I really appreciate about this facility is that they have top of the line oxygen chambers. You can sit up, it's broad, it's spacious, you can look out. The staff, phenomenal, always looking at you making eye contact, you can hear and speak to them. You can watch beautiful videos, lots of comedies, what I chose to keep you, you know, in focus. And for me, that was very comforting. The staff was very comforting, very knowledgeable, always reassuring. I really felt like I was putting my life in their hands, and I was, and they were phenomenal at it, always keeping me at ease, always letting me know that they were in touch with me. If I needed to be out of there, I could but I didn't have any ill effects as far as being in the chamber. It was always comforting. And uh, so I can really reassure you that that is something that 
you will benefit just just the chamber itself was really uh, it was a positive environment well I have to I have to add this too resoundingly you are going to go through changes for me as a Lyme patient I I have experienced firsthand the the Herx reaction and that is your body's reaction to all those bacteria and parasites dying off so you really have to you really have to stick to it and that's where the staff again comes in because they were reassuring like clockwork It'd be like climbing the hill at the first part of the week and hitting the plateau experience nausea extreme fatigue uh, all of those things that would would occur when when some things die off dying off in your body like a bacteria but when I would go into the chamber I would go in it's let's say it's a chronic pain of eight and come out at four or five and that happened for many many weeks but towards the end around treatment 26 I was able to get mental clarity it was like a, a veil lifted like a fog lifted I could recall things it was something that was internal I had prior to treatment experienced internal shaking that was gone I have had rashes that in swelling at each joint uh, something that I used to love to do is the arts whether it be uh, playing music or hand stitching things but I couldn't do it anymore because it would swell and for days and days even if I tried for an hour to crochet or knit it would all swell and you could see it I can say now that that is gone there is no inflammation in any of the joints I still have my mental clarity, which I'm so thankful for. And I want anybody out there to please inform yourself, meet this staff, come to the facility, and experience it because it really is life changing. It's life changing. Every little detail in this center, they have consciously thought about how to help you and I be healthier as we're going through this change. Even details like the flooring, the flooring doesn't put out any. VOCs, there's no EMF uh, frequencies coming out of you know the the uh, outlets. In other words, everything's wired, so there's nothing there that's in you know in our air. There's nothing to make it. Everything is toxic free, even the flooring, even the paint. There's how phenomenal is that, and what care have they taken to look at all those details so that when you're in an environment that you are going to get optimum healing here. And I really appreciate that about this facility here in Marin. And I know you will too. In fact, it's so, it has all just transformed my life so much that I want to volunteer as a patient advocate or to inform the community here because I've come from Texas and here it is in Marin. And I would do, I would go any distance to come to this facility because the staff is so caring and I see all the care that they have taken in providing uh, the healthiest rejuvenating center through hyperbaric oxygen recovery. So thank you for that.